Hello YouTube, I'm here with uh, another dive video, yeah, dumpster dive video. By the way, I picked up this on uh, the marketplace, I had been wanting this for a while. Trying to save up all my ex my being rewards points, but I didn't need to. A friend of mine got me a $25 card, so that was pretty cool. But I have the first one, of course. Of course, I got the first one. Came with the disc and the actual game. And I was wondering if they had a second one out, and apparently they did. I'd known about it for like two years or so, but I never got down to buying it up until now. But anyways, let's get down to business. Have a bit of a haul. Somewhat a big haul. Somewhat a little haul. Here we are. Let's see, what should I start out with? I guess we'll start out with the fact that I found another board. That's a board for the Wii, of course. Then I found this poster. I don't really care much for this shit. I don't like Call of Duty. Call of Duty can suck my ass, and anybody else who plays this garbage can too, but whatever. I'll probably get to one of my brothers since they like this garbage. And I know they like those Call of Duty posters. Don't really... Like I said, I don't really care about it, and I don't care about anybody who really plays it, but, you know, sometimes to each their own, in a sense. I don't know. Whatever. I am not a follower. I have this Skylander Strike uh, Trap Team Guide. And a World of Warcraft Warlords of Drag Draenor Guard Guide. Drainer Guide, huh? I guess they make a freaking strategy guide for every new addition to that stupid game. Why? I don't know. I mean, seriously, if you're going to keep making strategy guides for every every new expansion to Warcraft, then who the hell's actually going to pay for it? 20 bucks. I mean, boot out 20 bucks for every one of the strategy guides. There's a... HDMI cable. I'm trying to think. There's supposed to be something else. Oh, it's right there. Okay, I'll get it in a bit. We have a game, Fallout 3. I don't know if it's supposed to be two discs. It looks like two discs, but this is disc one. Last time I found Fallout, the disc was all beat up, the, and it was only one disc. I got this, Resident Evil 6, but I guess it's only this too, which is appears to be a voiceover pack. I don't know why the hell they need a voiceover for it. Kind of stupid to make that crap. Of course, another of this. A lot of people seem to just throw this game away. Mag found a movie, The Moments, or let me see, no, The Monuments Man. <laughs> I found this, but it's not Halo Reach. It's Ghost Recon 2. Okay, I guess we'll continue with games and just kill that off. I found two games that are Japanese for PS3. The first one we'll go ahead and put. Oh yeah, I found this card in the dumpster too. Pokemon. Let's go and put that wherever. But uh, we have Sonic the Hedgehog. And check it out. See, it's all in, it's in Japanese. There's no manual to it. But the game is in there. And my brother has tried out, tried them out on his PS3. So they do work on the PS3. 
there's that one and the other one is Metal Gear Online as you can see like I said look at that it says Metal Gear in English but Japanese stuff on it and there it is the game in there the games are working order like I said my brother tried both of them out they work good let me see and like if you look on that Japanese one of them has Japanese numbers the other one I don't think so much now this one says for Japan only on the disc and I don't think this one does oh for home use made in Japan but it just says made in Japan we have this game actually my little brother has it on Xbox but it, his is an American copy anyways moving on forward let me see found a blaster it's a Wii move I mean not a Wii motion it's a move blaster move blaster also another turtle beach headset it's an X1 looks to be an order it was missing something though let me see where I put it it was missing something I don't even remember where I put it Oh yeah, okay, I found it. It was missing something. Well, it's not only missing, it's missing two parts. It's missing the part that goes to the controller, which, you know, I, I don't mind because I don't really talk on the controllers or talk through the mics. So it's just going to be like that. But it was missing this, and luckily I found this ages ago, maybe almost three years ago. So it works. I tried it out, and it, it actually works. And the last thing I found... Was this guitar? Well, basically, just move that shit out of the way there. Looks like a pretty cool guitar. I think it works too, but I don't know. I haven't tried it yet. Anyways, there you have it. I hope anybody liked what I found. Thanks for watching. Uh, I guess that's about it for now. I'm probably going to get back down to playing the. Death Miles 2X and hopefully finishing up some more of the stuff tonight if I don't go to sleep anytime soon. But anyways, thanks for watching. As always, I'll see you guys on the next video. Subscribe if you want. I'll subscribe back to you. I haven't been, but I'll try. It's just I've been really, really busy or really, really out of it lately. So, well, I guess that's the end of the video. See you guys later.